Hey, we are back with another video, man. In this video, we are taking on Illinois and we are taking on Purdue. Now, I know it's almost been a week, but just getting my thoughts together, just living life outside of YouTube. But as you can see, we got to beat every single category to turnover differential. And bro, we are closing in on 20 career intercepts. We got 17 out of 20, so I believe we can do that this year. School record is 22, and we can top that. But as you can see, Oregon State lost to... Utah, bro, that is crazy. They jumped up to number seven. We are behind Michigan State and Alabama. As of right now, from week to week, we all know that could change. So we're just going to keep playing our game. We're playing our best football right now. We want to continue that down the stretch and hopefully make it to the college football playoffs. But here we are, baby. First game. They're coming in at one and six. That's crazy. First and ten. Whoa, come on, don't take control of my player, but Miles Scott picks up eight. I, I don't like that, but it is what it is. All right, second and seven, play action. Bro, he got all kinds of time. No, combat, we own that. We are on that. That pass is dropped. That's going to bring up a third and seven. Now, y'all do me a favor, man. Like, comment, subscribe on the video. Comment on the video also. Y'all let me know. Oh, Damn. First down grabbed by that tight end tip Raymond. But let y'all 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 just do me a favor, man. Like I say, like, comment, subscribe on the video. It don't cost you nothing. It's free of charge. That picture the outside, that just not going nowhere. There's too many red jerseys around, and that goes for a negative rush. But who does he remind you of? As far as cornerback, it could be past, present, the future, it don't matter. Let y'all let me know. Is that pass fall incomplete? Who does this cornerback remind you of? First and 10 in the run again. I'm, I'm, yo, I'm really proud of our defensive front, man. Because they have been, like, <laughs> the whole front four has definitely been the MVP so far this season. Because they, they've been shutting a lot of stuff down, especially against running teams. They definitely been holding their own. Bro, we nearly picked it off. We were just literally a split second too late to react to that play. Second and 10. Oh, we on that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We on that. We might take a little step for him, but hey, we're going to hold our ground. All right, 39. And this is not going nowhere, bro. They just too many red jerseys around. First and 10. We are 14 to nothing. Yo, he didn't have time to let that play develop as he gets sacked. That's going to break with second and 15. Bro, I know y'all seen that Jordan Tennessee game, bro. It just like, <laughs> yo, that could that should have been a safety, bro. But I'm, I'm, bro, I'm disappointed that Tennessee only scored 13 points, bro. I was like, y'all, y'all know for the folks that don't know, I'm a real life Florida Gator fan, bro. And for Tennessee only to score 13 points, where they been averaging like 50 points a game. It is it, it, definitely. I thought it'd be a lot more, more competitive game all around. You feel me? But it is it, it, it's crazy. It is definitely disappointing. I just it, everybody was expecting the, the ball. We all knew George was gonna be good. Oh, let's go! Hold up, let's go! Let's go! We're turning things to a touchdown. Let's go! Bro, that is a school record. Yes. Interceptions in the season. It was now. We was tied. Now we officially got 10 on the seat, yo. Y'all let me know who does he remind you of. First and 10. But like I say, everybody, everybody know George is good. Um, it, it, it just going to that game, we thought it was gonna be one of those heavyweight fights. And you know, Georgia just went for the knockout blow early, <laughs> and that was that. But the, the LSU Alabama game was it was definitely it was more exciting to watch, even from my point of view. And you know, Alabama is, is definitely they would not make a college football playoffs, not with two losses. Oh, let's go, man! We own that, man. But yeah, Alabama is definitely not going to the college football playoffs. I can see definitely Georgia. You know, um, a team that you got to watch out for is TCU. So don't sleep on TCU, man. I know Clemson lost. 
Tennessee loss, Alabama, I mean, Alabama loss. So, yeah, it, it, it's college football is just crazy right now, man. It's definitely crazy. So we are pitching a shutout, man. Twenty-eight to seven, twenty-eight nothing actually. Oh, nice throw, nice catch, pick up of sixteen on the play. They are hurrying back things to the line. And also, I did a community tab vote, man. The Aaron Campbell Jr. series will be coming after this, of course, after this series complete. Um, just let me do the you know backstory and all that, and I got y'all. Just wanted to throw that out there. Nice throw over the middle, third and four, bro. I'm not playing no no. We all know this is gonna be a hail mary. Just not allowing nothing to happen. He can't even get the ball off as we end that half. You know, we dominate, man, and they just jumping off sides, man. We got these boys shook. First and 15. Has crossed the middle, and that is complete. And it's going to bring up a third and nine. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. He wanted that. Yes, bro, he wanted that little quick little pass, and we cut that out. Sometimes we take a gamble. Sometimes we play out of zone, but that's just who this kid is. Definitely who this is. And I, bro, what the f <laughs> Yo, somebody catch this dude. Arguably, did they best play so far in this game? And big shout out to the subscriber that mentioned that um, when I did the running back series, like, nice throw, nice catch, okay. But um, when I, in the future, if I ever do another running back series, um, you know, don't don't hold on to the, you know the turbo button so quickly. And big shout out to the subscriber. I can't mention his name. I can't think of his name right now. But you know, a lot of times I be holding the sprint button, and that gives the defenders the time to you know shed the blocks real quick. And the quarterback is just bro. He is just going crazy right now. They end up scoring. I forgot to record it, so. It is what it is, man. We still up big, man. 49 to 7. But big shout out to the subscriber for that, man. I'm definitely gonna remember that in the future. Let's go. All right, third and six, man. Three minutes left before this game is over, bro. We just oh we can't can we do back-to-back -back national championships? And that's the end of this game, man. Stick around for game number two. We end up winning 49 to 7. Back to back whole games, man. We dripped out red with everything. I wish they helmets was red. You feel me? But what a big hit on your boy King. And that's only good for three seconds. And that would be crazy, bro. They had some red helmets to go along with, you know, the red jerseys, socks, shoes. That that would be different. That definitely would be different. All right, first and ten. Screen, bro. We are on that, man. But like I said, we just gonna continue to play our game. We actually jumped up to number one. And I feel like it's only one team that's standing in our way. And we all know who that is. But if you don't know, the Michigan Wolverines. So that, I think that's going to be a really good game. This dude is just running for his life. As, like I say, the defensive line, the whole defensive front is definitely playing lights out this year. And that pass only good for four as Gary Miller picks up four. That's going to break with second and six. A little read option, and we, yo, we own that, man. Kings only picks up four. All right, third and two. Mm -mm. Let's go. All right, first and ten. Nah, nah, bro, you just, just bro, we own that, man. All right, second and twelve. And I realized on a place like that, though, I have to contain outside containment. You know, make them turn it back inside where my where my help is. And I'm I'm, I'm learning a little stuff like that, man. Y'all y'all just bear with me. Y'all give me some insight or some tips because I don't know everything. I've been playing this game for a long time. I mean, for a very long time. Not just this game, just games in general. As so we also clearly crossed the field to make the overfield tackle. Third and four, and that is complete as they keep the drive alive. Garrett Miller picks up 22. First and 10, a little speed option, and that is good for four. All right, second and six, man. Let's tighten up. They, they slowly creeping into this red zone. 
another speed option. That's just not going over. That defensive front and linebackers are like, doing what they supposed to do. And I feel like we, we are playing as a whole unit. And that pass is caught. And they are in the red zone while Sean Rice picks up 15. And I feel like that's why we are just playing as well. That is intercepted. Let's go. Well, that pass is intercepted. But like I say, as we are playing good on offense, I mean, the offense is picking up the pace, you know, it's early in the season it started a little bit slugs. he actually fumbled the ball i thought the play was dead that's why i stopped but the offense is coming along the, the, the bro the number one defense in the nation i don't need that special teams you know the coaches calling the right plays everybody just believing in each other and that's why we number one man now they know can we go back to back and bro look at this fighting off a block and making the safety now, we all know this kid can cover, he can intercept. Not only that, you, you got to do more than just, you know, that. You got to be able to tackle. And I feel like this kid is one of the best, if not the best, tackling DBs in the nation. Oh, we hanging a 30-piece on these boys, man. The game is not even over. That's why I say it's just like we are playing. We are the hottest team right now. Definitely one of the hottest teams in college football. And it's definitely showing, all right, third and eight. As we get another tackle, we are on the stat sheet once again. Now we hang a 50 piece on these boys. That's crazy. And I know a few years ago when they had Rondell Moore in real life, god damn. <laughs> this dude got down back of foot on the field, but they they, they kind of always gave Ohio State problems, especially a couple years ago. They had Rondell Moore and they played at Purdue. Yeah, a couple teams always give Ohio State problems, but oh, that quarterback goes down for another sack, bro. I can't believe we hung up 50 on these boys. Why can't the offense always play like this? And I know for times in games, you know, we face different teams and they, you know, they got a game plan coming in, but. It's just like we we got too much firepower offense to be not putting up fifty plus points, but that's all we got for this episode, man. Like, comment, subscribe on the video. It's your boy CR8 logging out to next video, man. Y'all know I'm gone. I wanna salute every nigga who run with me And it's a secret everything that you done with me Cause it's a couple niggas that practice loyalty Family